Hi, so hello good people that are interested in property. Um, I've been asked a couple of questions recently. The first one was, what is Albert Einstein doing behind me? He's there to inspire me to think. So when I walk into the room, into my office, I see Albert and I don't react, I will think about the problem. Or at least that's what he's supposed to do. So, um, the other question was, how do we, um, as property experts, how do we identify a hotspot? So what's a hotspot? Why do we, how do we choose where we are about to um, go into and, and find a property? Um, the simplest way is by data analysis. We look at um, all sorts of things, rental yields, um, prices and, uh, and general market dynamics. Uh, but the t key things that will tip us is what we call, or what I refer to as anchor points. What's an anchor point? So an anchor point is proximity to various key considerations and what people actually need. So an anchor point would be a train station. Uh, an anchor point would be a school, primary or secondary school, college, etc. Anchor points is proximity to high streets, proximity to shopping areas. And you'll get the general picture. Those are anchor points. We have a list of key anchor points and what we do is we go through and we analyse. Those anchor points are generally what create proximity to the things that people need and they are what drive things like rental prices and they're also what drives um, desirability. Um, you take yourself out to suburban areas and you remove yourself from um, uh, towns and you've got different anchor points. Um, some people are, um, really like the idea of rural space. The race for space is a, is a classic example. Um, people have moved from urban areas into, um, uh, into, into the suburbs and created environments outside. Um, hotspots though, that's the, um, that's the, uh, the key consideration. They will also be fueled by um, regeneration. So regeneration values come in from um, infrastructure upgrades such as what um, the government will do, um, Crossrail 1 being one, High Speed Rail 2 um, was another, uh, another big, big key considerator. They generally drive the prices up, um, but you've got to be aware that the factor usually gets built up on hype and it will form a, um, a, a, using an infrastructure upgrade such as Crossrail, it will create a hype, it will drop, it will plateau, then it will arrive, and then it will go up um, at a much more gradual rate. So be aware of the hype, but I hope that goes to help, and that's a little bit about hotspots. If you want to know more, please subscribe, up there, down there. Um, and um, and uh, we'll tell you a little bit more about property as the weeks go by.